right, guys, it is time for the entertainment <laughs> news. Yes, it is to East Flash. All right, so starting off our first gist, after five oh days in God. EFCC study, fast rising Nigerian rapper Zlatan has regained freedom following his arrest alongside fellow rapper Naira Mali and three others over their alleged involvement with cybercrime. Zlatan was released alongside his personal assistant Raman Jago and his house help. Although at the moment EFCC is yet to give full details of Zlatan's release and Naira Mali's continued detention, David Doe, who recently celebrated his first child and daughter in Made on her fourth birthday, took to his Instagram page to share a photo of, of Zlatan. Now he captioned the photo with the quote, Zanku free. People love you, Sha. Or yeah, go back to making history at Zlatan Ibile. Now, while some initial reports claim that it was David O who got some senior advocates to rescue them, <laughs> Aramoguchi, a close ally of Zlatan, has come out to refute the claims, saying that it is all lies. Now, according to him, Oli Olamide and Burner Boy came through for them when they needed help. Another close friend of Zlatan further confirmed this, stating that David O was merely a social media keyboard <laughs> supporter. <laughs> 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 What is really happening? I, mean, I kind of feel bad for David. He's always dragged into all these kind of messes. I don't know why. Uh, maybe because, I don't know why. Okay, like, so, uh, uh, should we talk about David now? Or maybe because David is always... Like he commented on that post. Yeah. Like finally or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So... If you, well, were, you have if, tea on this. You have tea on this, though. With the okay, what's, what's the tea? Just spill the tea. You don't have any tea. Please, give yes, us the tea. Give us the tea. No, it's just good. It's just, it's just, uh, it's you just good. You see how it's giving disclaimer in case they come for you. No, no, but it's on the Instagram. It's on social media, so tell us so, about so, it. So, according to EFCC, they are still keeping um, Naira Mali yeah. because it's always Latin, <laughs> Ramajago. Yeah. And, of course, the guy who became popular, people were now using him as a meme, yeah. um, released those oh, guys. Yes, yes. Now, they detained Naira Mali because they said they still have more evidence to still keep him. Oh, wow. We should not think Zlatan and the rest are free mm. yet because yeah, they say have the case, but they're just on bail. Bail, yeah. yeah. Okay, my only problem with this story is the fact that I know when Naira Mali was coming out very publicly about his stance on Yahoo Boys, one would think that he had some sort of backup plan or he was very, very clean. Like right, that right. kind of situation where you come for me, like, you know, when you're driving yeah, no and then you have all your papers yeah, 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 yeah. and then yeah. police stop Shania. Confident. Amanda, and like, this is what so you want? funny. What do you want? <laughs> Amanda, this like, is so, quick segue. This is so funny because I have all my papers. Like, everything's complete. So sometimes I'm just like, stop me. Stop me. No, so but it, it's not weird when you don't have your papers and then they stop you and you're confident and you're posing like, mm-mm. Right. They're like, I don't actually have my papers. Like, right, right. That's so the best way for me to explain You make a very good point. Thing. I mean, if you're like, going to... I don't know, the morals are morals. What's right is right. What's wrong is wrong. If you're going to be blatant and be so open about what is yeah. wrong and stand behind it and stand for it, then, my G, you better have backup. So this one, I are still there, according to them. So, I so mean, social media is a mess. Like I was saying, so they put up the, um, the story on a particular blog on Instagram. Yeah. David commented. Yeah. If he wasn't involved, he would have said, not be me, yeah. but he let that slide. Yeah. Slide. Then I remember Gucci put up a post saying, this guy wasn't involved. He's only supporting on keyboards, yeah, yeah, blah, yeah. blah, blah, blah. Okay, you know what? Let's check out this clip of our Mugichi ranting. <laughs> yeah. mm. Bonner boy, now these people show love where we need dead people. Now them show love. Bonner boy and Lamy, they make anybody no go the bobo now on top gram say, now one person call a lawyer. If you don't know story, you don't know. So it's, it's, well, it's just crazy. I mean... And you know what? Lamy didn't like this video. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. <laughs> but, and I guess this also okay. goes to show what we say about um, like the silent people who do the silent yes. stuff. Yeah. Like, you don't know what I'm doing behind yeah. the scenes because I'm not coming out to put a post saying, oh, because Bonaboy didn't put post yeah. or Lamy yeah. didn't put up a post. You can't they say that I'm not like posting. Yeah, right, it's right. So it's like, okay. But the then shout out forward. to them for helping. At least they came through. At least two people if came through. If it's David, though, if it's Bonaboy, if it's Lamy, anybody. I'm expecting this help, though. Why not? Because that's what people are now ranting about They're still now. innocent till they're guilty. So maybe they help guilty. them Fair to enough. clear glitter. Thank you, Amanda. That is very... Yeah. You're a G for that one. Okay. All right, all right. <laughs> On that note, we move swiftly along. Yes. Speaking of Burner Boy, actually, yes, the Nigerian singer, a.k.a. the African giant, has announced that he will be leaving social media platforms, mm. all social media platforms, permanently, guys. Mm. According to the Dangote singer, his social media handles will be controlled by his management, who will only share promotional posts. He wrote, I'm leaving social media platform, all social media platforms permanently. They are now strictly for my show dates and new music. I love you all from the bottom of my heart. Love and positivity to all. Now, you might remember that our very own David o, again, <laughs> had said before, um, I think like last month, that he was going to be off his phone for a month until if he I dropped yet. a new album. 
But however, he's actually been posting stuff often and we still haven't seen or heard much about the album. Mm. So do you guys think, in view of Davido's P, do again, you think Davido that... inside the gist. I know, Davido will not be so much, we have to bring him in again. Yeah. But the point is, no, the reason I brought him in is because <laughs> I feel like, um, do you guys think it's possible? It's about time for Bonner Boy to even go up. So now, 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 now wow. it's, a it's a different, it's a different case. It's a different case um, with Davido. <laughs> Davido wants to go off yeah. to record music. To focus and come Bonner back. Boy is more. Of, Why does he um, have to go off? Why does Bonner Boy have to go off? No, Bonner Boy is going off yeah. because lately Why is Bonner Boy time? has been speaking his mind yeah. Yeah. on and his social have media been coming pages. For him. And people oh, okay. have been coming well, for him. Mm. That's the reason. That, that's the reason we think. Okay. That's, that's the reason we so think. So you were talking so, about whether it can be pulled off. That was your question, right? Yeah. I think that Bernard Boy can pull it off. I yeah, think, yeah, I yeah, think he can. Permanent, oh. That's no, no, no. You now, is, what you'll be posting more is, on is your long. page now yeah. is tour dates, I'm at this show, exactly. I'm at this show. So it's not going to be doing all those usual commentary. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you know what's crazy is that. He can do it. But you know what's crazy is that normally what Brenner Boy has on his main page, mm -hmm. on his actual profile on Instagram, is tour dates and like, you know, updates about what he's, his it's performances just on his and updates stuff. That so it's on his Insta story that, that he's always putting. Sorry, um, I actually just thought something feelings. really Think funny. about international deals before you sign them. <laughs> so maybe he wants to stop giving advice and so just. I, I, I think so it's in collaboration with his management. I like think your my management guy. should handle I your want social to say media. Something very I really silly. think so, especially when you. I'm just giving a disclaimer. I'll say something very silly. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Listening. So I'm just thinking that he'll open another account with his real name. <laughs> To be calling people then, out. <laughs> and then you have like 200 followers. <laughs> and then you have a rat thing. boy that we comment when you abuse him, all those posts that I used to abuse him. Yeah. We oh. comment. There was one that I posted that I used to knock people off. Yeah, and yeah, they yeah, come yeah, for yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. So it's about time his management just say, my guy. I, I think so. You can take all of this, you can call the person or send a text, but don't do it on social media where yeah. everybody can yeah. watch it yeah. and see it. This is, I mean, this so is a good thing. decision for him. Yeah, I think so. Too. Okay. All right. <laughs> okay, moving on to foreign news. 35 year old um, Jeremy Mix, yeah. who aka is the odd felon, as well talks that is no longer with billionaire heiress um, Chloe Green. He has the daughter of Sir Philip Green, um, who is believed to be engaged to. He has the odd model was pictured on Tuesday or caused it up with fellow model and of course Instagram star Andre Sasu as they stormed the red carpet at the opening of the 72nd Annual Keynes Film Festival, rocking coordinating black outfits. Also earlier in the day, um, the two models were spotted um, stepping out together to enjoy the sunshine and the French holiday location. Yes, this is adding to the fact that Topshop heiress Chloe Green was seen during a shoot in London last month without her rings. Yes, Jeremy has, wow. however, assured paparazzi that he himself and his partner Chloe Green are still together. And that's that. So, so y'all leave me alone. So, no, wow. So he doesn't wear a ring. Is it my ring? No. <laughs> the, so this is me trying to sound True. like me again yeah from the beginning of this relationship mm. people didn't support this yeah you know because he was rich babe he was mad and, yeah, he was mad, and he had his yeah. wife or they convict ex-con we so rich she babe. just fell in love and before you know sharp sharp they are dated sharp sharp the ring is involved okay. but right now <laughs> what is happening we don't know we actually don't know. But then, I mean, it's I'm still sure, there. I'm sure Jeremy's wife. They're bound be. to have personal issues. But so I'm just sure. because he's a rich guy and he fell on doesn't mean that, you know. He was still <laughs> married before Chloe started tripping. Mm. Uh, and then, now, Chloe is tripping and apparently they're supposed to be engaged. Are you people not supposed to be on the wife's part? Life. Are you people not supposed to be on the wife's side? No, but like. I think, what, what are we being on? There's nothing to be on. She didn't it. come out to complain. This is all speculation. She was complaining. Did, well, he did not tell us that. Jeremy's she was, what wife was she complaining. Was complaining about? About? That Chloe, that Jeremy is following um, Chloe because of the money, money blah, blah. She's yeah. Was she complaining? Who? Chloe. Okay. <laughs> is it your money? Wow, Amanda. Ah, so I you're on the side that. of the person who snatches so somebody else's So we are supporting the girls wife. now. No, Amanda is supporting but the hot no, no, no. But what I'm trying to say is that the babe did not complain. The babe is his wife. And she wants to be married to him. No, no. so the wife is complaining, actually. His wife that was married this to This my hot fellow husband is following money. Oh, yeah, that's what, that what you're saying. saying. Yeah, we're supporting Babati. Oh, <laughs> I thought you were moving on, moving on, moving on, moving on, moving on. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to move on from all this drama <laughs> and talk about talk show host Wendy Williams, who has opened up on her ongoing divorce from her estranged husband, Kevin Hunter. Now, during her Hot Topic segment on her talk show, the 50 year old, uh, 54 year old mother of one said that she is reclaiming her life and enjoying rediscovering her love of men as she spoke on her divorce. Now, the star also noted that their son, Kevin 
Hunter Jr. is currently home from college and sees both of his parents. She also addressed photos that emerged over the weekend of her and the man at an event. She confirmed that he was not a new boyfriend, but a member of her show security team. Now, in quotes, she said, I go out a lot because I'm a good time girl. I like to have fun, she told her enthusiastic audience. I'm right now as a young and pretty New York City girl phase. <laughs> now, she also added, I'm working on my divorce pleasantly right now. Now, you recall that earlier this year when the Williams filed for divorce from Kevin Hunter following 21 years of marriage after his mistress allegedly gave birth. Go, Wendy, go, Wendy, go. <laughs> I, was, I was waiting for this when she would bring a drama to her own. No, show. but then I like the fact that she she's just pleasantly hints, I mean, doing it, as she said. But, no, she's not doing it the way she does. This, this this is the problem I have. Okay. She's not doing it the, the way that a lot of actually, yes, a couple the of way have online she sits on other people's. Okay, so issues. I'm actually going to agree with you on that. But then it's her show. So other people, if other people want to come for her, they should come for her now. So here's the thing. So when so Wendy went off, yes. Wendy um so she's she's got okay. So she went off um some months ago yeah. on her show. She yeah, went yeah, off yeah, and yeah. was like, Somebody oh, I'm the Graves' disease yeah. thing, and so she had people filling in for yeah. her. She had them them, and then. She came back and people were like, ah, this baby, it's not only this your illness, that like, you're going to Something sort out like your marriage parole. And then, parole, like what you say. And then, <laughs> and then, so the comments when she came back, the first day back, people expected that, you know, she would spill tea, like, guys, my husband is a... Today on... On today on somebody. her topics, but, but I'm only talking about my divorce. Some people in the comments were like, wow, I'm over, wow. some people in the comments were like, I'm over <laughs> Wendy. Yes, you no. just focus on people's lives. So, it's interesting that she's, even, this is, and you're right, this is still not enough. If you go by how open she is about, like, other people's stuff. So, I have another theory. Do you okay. think, do you think they must have signed, like, a non-disclosure deal that don't come on your show that I'm no, producing I, 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 to nope. talk about. I don't think I so. actually don't think, I don't think so. so. Do you know I just think it's about it's because it's about her. Yeah. I mean, it's always easier to talk about other people, but when it's time to talk about yourself, it's harder. Maybe That's wrong things it. because I don't think her producers would have agreed to that because if you come and talk Which about your business, you know, you know, you know, you know, exactly what I'm if you if you talk about your divorce the drama, group, everyone else is talking yeah. about. I mean, give them the tea. Let them know. Yes. What's really happening? Break it down. Drag your husband. I'm sure what she's not over the divorce. No. When the Williams is a human being too, she loves this man. The guy has a baby with another. Other woman. Okay. So maybe she's hurting. Give her time. Give her time. Okay, okay sorry. alleged. Oh my goodness. <laughs> all right, guys. This is Tweetville, where we bring you all the savagery, humor, and craziness social media has to offer in five minutes or less. So mm -hmm. let's do this. Hmm. All right. <laughs> and this is a <laughs> so this is a picture of like five pots of food there is one of chicken of soup of stew and everything and, um, <laughs> and someone um tweeted when i'm broke i'm like i need to buy new clothes and look clean and then i receive a letter and this is me <laughs> oh! Oh, Jay. No, no, this is, this is not me, but I know people that do this thing like, oh. like, like let's eat oh, you never can oh tell my hey, what, oh like, my what am I buying so, clothes for? Me and my ex-boyfriend, like we're really close. <laughs> oh, Amanda, yeah, yeah. we're still really close. Yeah, we're still really close. Why? So then like we'll be broke, we'll have like 1k. You know, say, he's hungry, let's go and buy food. Now buy food, now rice, two. One for more. He's one that made, taught me all this nonsense. We're like, two for more. One beef, one shark, is one Yoruba? food, is Yoruba? one a body. Is he Yoruba? <laughs> oh, a body? What, what, Yoruba. Yeah, it's very Yoruba. Oh, that's very why Yoruba. I think my people like, tend to like, really like meat. I'm yeah, not like that. They just say, give me ah. rice, 15 air. Then, shaki, 100. Shaki, no. Like, I can't eat food nah. without meat. It's not that deep, guys. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'll put three. Like, oh, my goodness. Anyway, Nialonga tweeted, men will actually cry real tears over football, but not at their weddings. Like, I don't get it, right? Mm. And then someone replied, that's why I'm walking down the aisle to the Champions League song. We <laughs> the champions. OJ is having a ball. The champions. We were the <laughs> ah, no, that song is... Mm. Is emotional it's, enough, right? Yes, no. So, would it's you be emotional down, for you now. Would you agree to walk down the aisle with your babe? Like, we... we you know, no, it's not that serious. Know, weddings, <laughs> are for, weddings are for girls, so he can't do no, it. No, I'm not going to get it. No, but what if she suggests, it, like, would you agree? Like, we part through the song. We're champions in this thing, in mm. this love thing. Let's get no, married. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> I tried. Oh. Right, next one. <laughs> okay, Pengman said... Oh, he tweeted, I just saw one of those guys on Pulse and they asked this guy. So you guys know those one silly those videos. videos. Yeah, yeah, sorry, one of those videos on mm -hmm. Pulse. You guys know those silly videos yeah, online that yeah. a lot of media outlets do it now and they just ask people, spell this, spell that. Mm -hmm. Anyway, so this guy is like, I just saw one of those videos on Pulse and they asked this guy, do you have eardrums? And he replies, I can't disclose that. <laughs> <laughs> he said, what is wrong with Nigerians? If you don't 
So if you ask a question and you do not hear it well, just say, please say it again. Yeah, but that's, 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 that's trying to avoid any issue. Like, I can't discuss that. I'm going. Uh, that's, Some that's, of them will even say, God forbid. <laughs> God forbid. You know, that's why, you know that's why when you try, when you try to uh, go and do Vox Pop yeah. outside, mm. they don't want to answer you. Because they have that feeling that they will mess up and mm -hmm. you ridicule them online and on TV. So most of them don't like No, no, no. The thing is, some of these things sound bad. Like, I also watched one and said, do you have a spinal cord? And I said, I will not have in Jesus' name. So, yes! Like, it looks like, why are you wishing me disease so, or so, something? So the thing is, if you know <laughs> you, you have can't... eardrums, OJ, I can't disclose that. What can you not disclose about your eardrums? I can't disclose that, bye-bye. So that you will not go for that. Let's not talk. <laughs> all right, guys. <laughs> moving on. So Anna, your auntie said, admission to the... Oh, my gosh. This is amazing, guys. Prepare. So it says, admission today, one agbero-looking guy kept following me and was like, sister, Fine girl, Oimbo, wait now. And she was just tired and she's like, I knew I couldn't get rid of him. So I turned back and I was like, me? And he nodded and she was like, she made a shocked face and was like, wait, you didn't see me so? Guess what happened? <laughs> of course he ran. Did you get it? Yes, yes. yes. <laughs> I've been seeing this thing, I want no. to try it one day. It depends on the guy you use this it <laughs> Yes. Yes. Are you, Are you sure? Go, go. Let, let's touch I you. I can't see you. I can't see you. I can't see you. Come. They're like, okay, let's go. Let's go. You want to come with me? <laughs> you'll, be, you'll, be you'll be afraid. You'll be afraid. First, you said, can you see me? Now you're saying, come with me. Come with me. Let's go. What's that there? You know it's real. Anyway, and I think this is the last one. And real response we tend. Nigerians, when they're poor and they see someone else flexing, they will be like, the world passes away and it's lost thereof. <laughs> vanity, vanity upon, upon vanity. vanity. And then when they start making it in life, they're like, hey, in this life, make money or so they're not going to crop you, come out for picture. <laughs> no, no. Everybody does this on I Instagram. I love my people. Oh my God, and my yes. people love me. It's Instagram that scores this nonsense. But it's okay. <laughs> it's so true. Like, you'll be waxing deep. Oh, please, guys, yeah, money is not it everything. It is so like, true. And then you make some money. Yeah, enjoy life. Oh, let them not come out of the picture. Even Jesus drank wine. <laughs>